Naam. Um, shule ya upili ya Dagoreti. Eh, ilitolotonge mdomoni na St Anthony ya Kitale katika finali za kitaifa eh, katika mashindano ya shule za upili au sio lakini eh, licha ya kumaliza katika nafasi ya pili katika mashindano ya kitaifa walifuzu katika mashindano ya ukanda ule wa Afrika Mashariki wamerejea nyumbani eh, tumezungumza na wadau wamejifunza nini baada ya matokeo kwanza ya kitaifa pili mashindano haya ya ukanda ule ukanda wa Afrika Mashariki katika mashindano ya shule za upili hapo kauli ya wadau wa shule hiyo ya upili ya Dagoreti hai Rwanda let's just say it. there was a little bit of stiff, stiff competition from the opposing teammates yeah but all in all it was a good experience and we hope for the school to qualify again next year um what i can say was lazy to me it was a uh, close win the, the games at national level were competitive but we managed to become number two so we proceed, proceeded to east africa where where the competition was very tough and managed to become uh, at the group stage we succumbed you uh, pressure my fans a little to a time you know dai kuku mafans wa St Anthony walikuwa wengi sana so unajua ili nileta pressure kwetu sana unaona some players nika yo psych walilusio psych sasa so yo motivation ingefaa lakini tulijaribu ile tungeweza am um, mini form 4 nishafanya mtihani yangu nipate grade poor then nione kama kuna team itani sign huko kwa ma clubs niendelee na football umletu kuu ilikuwa kubeba hiyo trophy kuleta shuleni na tukufanikiwa kuibeba sasa tulikuwa na jituma tu ambaye hatukuwa nataka yani turudi shuleni hadi hatujafika wa finali we want to do better we want to be seen there every year on the national level even the region right now we have started from scratch again we are working hard training as usual no breaks for us every day we are here training from 4 to 6 this year the national games was 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 good was electric um people did not know that we will make it once again uh we made it all the way to the finals uh it was a shock on many but uh, what to say is that we don't talk much about what we are doing here we act uh we 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 strike we we sting so once we get the opportunity to do, do that we do it and uh, do it well ani wachache watano walio kuwa fast 11 ni watano tu so kuna wale walikuwa kwa bench wako lakini tutaweza kuchipanga tena tu ino dagoreti inajulikana kwa mambo ya michezo na mambo ya kielimu so what we normally do to ki admit kijana from one we want to find out the background history of this particular boy kijana anatuambia kwamba yeye alikuwa anafanya michezo huu na ile na ile na ile So then we strike on that and then start developing your talent. And finally we develop a team from right from form one. We will know who will do what. If you even they metfanya to me tap his talent and tunajua kijana ako na talent gani. Ni kitu tunaanza mapema. And um atu atu wesu banduka. Tutaendelea hivyo hivyo. Like uh, there was one boy tripo enda East Africa Afumana was playing and in fact he gave us two goals the boy is 15 years was playing so well so efficiently and you know this boy is in Afumana by the time he reaches form 4 si atakuwa ni mchezaji wa kutegemewa so we develop these talents right from form 1 of course there are also others who uh, because issue yetu inachukikana kwa mambo ya mchezo. Um, wengine wanatafuta nafasi. But we don't allow boys who join form 3. Our policy here is kijana anaingia form 1 and form 2. So that we start developing them. Nimesikia shule zingine zinaleta wanafunzi. Sijui zinatoa wapi zinaleta. But the great is known is a culture. It's an inbuilt culture that has been taking place for a long time. Sio jana 
kitu kimekaa kwa muda it has been nurtured with time bila shaka tandatema uvikwa pe